Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel and your daily love guidance reading. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate your love and support. And Aquarius, please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with all of you. I post a video every single day and it is impossible to relate to it each and every time. If you don't resonate, it isn't a message for you but for another group of Aquarius, okay? And also time is fluid in tarot so this reading could apply to you in the past, currently or in the future. All right, Aquarius, let's get to your reading. Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate love messages for Aquarius today. Love, Aquarius. Love. All right, this wants to come out. This one too. There's an extra, and I'm just going to take it. This is the bottom of the deck. Page of Swords in reverse. Okay. Let's take a look here. Aquarius. Okay, we've got the Seven of Pentacles here. It looks like someone is feeling all that they have been investing or invested in this relationship or in this connection has all crumbled down with the tower here. Uh, again, Aquarius roles can be switched here, so it could either be you or the other person's energy, but sometimes it could also be mixed. We've also got the Seven of Cups in reverse. It's almost like something has come to their senses or to your senses, okay? Something that you have realized that you have seen very clearly, but it took um, something very drastic or something very dramatic to happen in order for someone here to actually see that this is what truly is the whole picture. This is it, right? And we've got the Nine of Swords here. And because of that, there's a lot of sleepless, there are a lot of sleepless nights, crying, feeling depressed, a lot of suffering here um, and we've also we've also got the ace of wands in reverse so for some reason what I'm seeing here especially the ace of wands in reverse and the devil in an upright position it could have been a connection that I feel it was passionate at first but of course it has ended now with it, it being in reverse it started off very passionate and then it ended right and because there is a devil energy there's something very toxic uh, very negative uh, within this connection here some of you this could be a third party situation but not for all of you because the devil was one two three but the devil card could also mean jealous Jealousy, possessiveness, lying, cheating, uh, codependency, bad habits, whatever the case is, okay? But also, this is a connection that I feel that it is hard for either one of you, actually, to let go of. I feel like but one person has let go of it, okay? Ace of Wands in reverse. One of you has actually let go of this connection but it wasn't easy because the devil is a major kana. It is very, very powerful, very strong. Um, think about habits, bad habits that anyone would like to kick off. How long does it have to take and how hard it is, how much willpower it is that you need in order to kick off the habit. I'm just, I'm just making uh, an example here. Okay, so it was a connection that is very, very hard to release from. It's almost like a habit. It's almost like when someone is addicted to someone or addicted to a relationship, um, it's hard to, to let go, right? Either it's you or them, or it could be both of you. But what I'm seeing here is someone has decided to... Um, let go because 
there are three persons here, okay? Possibly a third party. Not for all of you, but definitely there was some sort of a deception that I feel um, that has been found out here with the tower card, but not in a pretty manner. It was very ugly and it has caused a lot of stress, a lot, a lot of stress here. But someone here feels that there is no choice but to let go um, because now they are finally seeing it very clearly. Before, maybe they were disillusioned or maybe, you know, they were confused, whether it's you or them, okay? And there was so much effort put into it. And it's like, what? After all of this, and this is what I'm getting? This is all I'm getting? And there's a lot of sadness here. But whoever you're dealing with, Aquarius, you know, this person I'm sensing is very... <sighs> this person is a nightmare, okay? This person is a nightmare. Um, Mm. It's a demon, right? There is a demon within them. And again, Aquarius, roles can be switched. So if you don't think they are the ones, then it must be you or, you know, vice versa. But the devil card, I feel like this person is battling with their demon. Um, demon or demons, <laughs> however many other negative or toxicity, toxic traits that they have or whatever that they are um, going through right now. With the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, again, it destroyed everything, right? Uh, but the thing is, Aquarius, what I'm seeing here, there's one Ace of Wands in reverse and we've got the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Uh, this is why I'm sensing this could be a third party situation. There's one relationship that is the, the new one, the newer one, that was a very passionate one. But there's another relationship here. I feel that this person could be married to or that, you know, again, roles can be reversed. So there are two, um, one is a marriage or if it's not marriage, like a committed relationship or a relationship that's been going on for, I've been like they have been together for a long time, okay? Or you have been together with them for a long time. Either or, but the Ace of Wands is the newer relationship here. So there is two, okay? I feel like um, most definitely this is a third party situation, but there is something very shocking that has happened here. And Aquarius, this is you, right? The Page of Swords in reverse. So there's some sort of spying and stalking, investigating and trying to find out what is going on what actually happened, trying to seek for answers, but in a very inquisitive manner, as in, you know, really, really actually wanting to find out. Again, Aquarius, I'm sensing here with the magician in reverse, whoever you're dealing with here uh, really has got, <laughs> oh, I wouldn't actually want to be involved or be a part um, of this chaos, okay? It's very chaotic. It's almost like with the tower car, it's almost like it affected everyone, 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 okay? It affected, some of you could have children involved or, you know, a family, all of that. It affected everyone here. Because this person, okay, the magician in reverse with the devil card right here, you know, very deceptive energy, could be very manipulative, using their power, abusing their power as well. Um, could have painted themselves to look like an angel, but it's actually a devil, okay? A devil in disguise, am I saying it correct? So, but Aquarius, um, there's an energy of a lot of stress here, right? And also there's a confusion for some of you, not all of you, um, not all of all of you, okay, could be could have alcohol problems or not you, I'm saying anyway, doesn't matter you or them, you know who you are, you know where you stand. 
but um, with the seven of cups here in reverse and with the devil energy and the magicians so some of them um, someone here could battle also with alcoholism or drugs not all of you okay but we've got the knight of pentacles but Aquarius it looks like someone does feel sorry here I feel like the knight of pentacles is an offering coming back but it's very slow and there's a high priestess here so knight of pentacles is the slowest card slowest knight actually the slowest card in the deck um, but there is something it's slow but it's steady and it's coming back around possibly to either apologize but the knight of pentacles is also the most hardworking pentacle knight and um, this could also mean friendship sometimes okay um, coming back in to say that they are sorry you or them or wanting to either reconcile or to have some sort of closure you know whatever the case is but I look like someone here is coming right back around whether it's you or them you know wanting to offer something that is um, solid here but it's taking a long time it's ta taking a very very long time um, because <laughs> because they're still battling with their demons here there's still a lot of unresolved issues I feel that they are going through whether it's you or them okay however within <laughs> high priestess here maybe this is just an intention and wanting to but with the high priestess being the quiet keeping quiet and no forward movement and actually if you look at the horse here it's it's not moving okay it's actually not moving it's on a standstill but there is an intention of wanting to come back around and say they're sorry or whatever the case is to reconcile um but they are keeping very quiet about it there's still there's still no movement forward they're still not actually taking any actions towards you or you them okay the magician is in reverse here hmm. this is different aquarius Anyway, I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And also, I do private reading. My email address is in the description box below. If you like to book me, just send me an email. I don't do 50 minutes reading anymore. It's 30 minutes or 30 minutes emergency reading. If nothing else, Aquarius, uh, as you know, I post a video every single day. I uh, hope to see you tomorrow and also please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care, Aquarius. Bye.